Escotoma is an area of partial alteration in the field of vision consisting of a partially diminished or entirely degenerated visual acuity that is surrounded by a field of normal Euro, or relatively well preserved Euro vision. Every normal mammalian eye has a scotoma in its field of vision, usually termed its blind spot. This is a location with no photoreceptor cells, where the retinal ganglion cell axons that compose the optic nerve exit the retina. This location is called the optic disc. There is no direct conscious awareness of visual scotomas. They are simply regions of reduced information within the visual field. Rather than recognizing an incomplete image, Patients with scotomas report that things disappear on them. The presence of the scotoma can be demonstrated subjectively by covering one eye, carefully holding fixation with the open eye, and placing an object in the lateral and horizontal visual field, about 15 degrees from fixation. The size of the monocular scotoma is 5A, 7 degrees of visual angle. Scotoma is a symptom of damage to any part of the visual system, such as retinal damage from exposure to high-powered lasers, macular degeneration and brain damage. The term scotoma is also used metaphorically in psychology to refer to an individual's inability to perceive personality traits in themselves that are obvious to others. Presentation of pathological scotoma, symptom-producing, or pathological. Scotometer may be due to a wide range of disease processes, affecting any part of the visual system, including the retina, the optic nerve and even the visual cortex. A pathological scotoma may involve any part of the visual field and may be of any shape or size. A scotoma may include and enlarge the normal blind spot. Even a small scotoma that happens to affect central or macular vision will produce a severe visual handicap whereas a large scotoma in the more peripheral part of a visual field may go unnoticed by the bearer because of the normal reduced optical resolution in the peripheral visual field. Causes Common causes of scotometer include demyelinating disease such as multiple sclerosis, damage to nerve fiber layer in the retina due to hypertension, toxic substances such as methyl alcohol, avambutol and quinine, nutritional deficiencies vascular blockages either in the retina or in the optic nerve and macular degeneration, often associated with aging. Scintillating scotoma is a common visual aura in migraine. Less common, but important because they are sometimes reversible or curable by surgery, are scotometer due to tumors such as those arising from the pituitary gland, which may compress the optic nerve or interfere with its blood supply. Rarely, scotometer are bilateral. One important variety of bilateral scotoma may occur when a pituitary tumor begins to compress the optic chiasm and produces a batemporal paracentral scotoma, and later, when the tumor enlarges, the scotomas extend out to the periphery to cause the characteristic batemporal hemianopsia. This type of visual field defect tends to be obvious to the person experiencing it but often evades early objective diagnosis as it is more difficult to detect by cursory clinical examination than the classical or textbook but temporal peripheral hemianopia and may even elude sophisticated electronic modes of visual field assessment. In a pregnant woman, scotometer can present as a symptom of severe preeclampsia, a form of pregnancy-induced hypertension. Similarly, scotometer may develop as a result of the increased intracranial pressure that occurs in malignant hypertension. See also, distorted vision, floater, visual field, detection, Amsler grid, horizontal eccentricity, perimetry, visual field test, types, binasal hemianopsia, batemporal hemianopsia, blind spot, cortical spreading depression, scintillating scotoma, references.